Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Hogwarts Legacy, the evilish campaign. Uh, please ignore the Hufflepuff on the screen right now. Uh, that's the that's the Saturday character uh, that I stream. I am now streaming for the set people who show who can only make it for the Saturday morning streams. Uh, she is going to be an attempt at a plant focused build. I want to see how viable a plant build is. Just curiosity's sake. But that's not why you're here. You're here to watch Jameson try to be as evil as the game will allow you to be evil, which is not very evil. No, not really. Wow. He's more likely to be voted class clown than he is to be actually thrown in juvie for anything. Uh, as evil as the game and myself are willing to be, um, because I just can't bring myself to be mean to animals or house elves. I, I, I can't. There's only so much so far I'm willing to go in animals and house elves is the line for me. Keep hitting that button. Where am I going? What am I doing? Uh, you know what? Let's go this. We'll do these two. We'll do the Phoenix Rising and the Sky is the Limit. And maybe, just maybe, we'll see if uh, Sebastian sends me an owl to go do his last quest to get Havada Kadabra. Deke has some exciting news to share. What is it, Deke? Hello, Deke. Professor Weasley said you had an idea. Indeed, Deke does. Deke knows that you want to learn about all sorts of beasts. And Deke recently heard rumors of a phoenix nest in a nearby mountain. A phoenix nest? I wonder if it belongs to the phoenix Natty mentioned. The one Harlow and the poacher pack are after. Deke would not doubt it. If Deke has heard of it, surely the nasty poachers have as well. Which means it could be in danger. Well, I'd better go and rescue it then, hadn't I? Deke thinks so. So majestic a beast should not fall into such vile hands. Deke is not sure why, but Deke feels that saving a phoenix might help to make amends for what happened with Deke's prior master. Deke hopes that you are able to find the phoenix and bring it to the room where it will be safe. You know what, actually, while I'm here, we've already bred cash, uh, thresholds. Thresholds? Whatever. We've already bred skeleton horses. So, um, and I know there is a challenge for Hello. breeding different animals. Okay. So what we're gonna do first of all. Okay. Mm -hmm. Especially this night. Oh, you're eating. Uh Oh, that was a cute little burp. He belched. Did you guys hear the Niffler belt? Where did the other post scheme go? Not that I, um... Well, you might have double to do that. And just click the resources real quick. Mm -hmm. There you are. You are hiding behind the breeding pen. Now let's breed pup skins. Yeah. Is it thirty minutes for everything? We'll have to look because yeah. Yeah. 
Oh, it's 25 minutes for the post game. Yeah. I mean, all the liquid warmer or I mean, you just usually use a dropper and make them swallow it. So you might be able to. Oh, that's right. We never, we were never able to find a male uh, moon calf. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. And go up here. Okay. We've already bred. Uh, yeah. Thanks for everybody. He's trying to eat. No, not you. No. You're highlighted. Now I'm saying, like, you were highlighted. Why weren't you, like, being picked? The one being I have come upon a difficult time and I need a friend. There we go. And it was highlighting one creature and it's not interacting with it the way I wanted it to. Hey. Are you familiar with the hamlet of Byendale? It's south of the castle. Uh. I think the cave that Doran wanted us to find is near there. That's two. Waiting on now is for Sebastian to send his regards. Come on, what are goodies are here. I could have sworn there was Ashwinder eggs right here somewhere. Guess not. But anyway, that's two Brittany pens going. <coughs> no, no, there's. Are there any creatures in this. about the swamp vivarium yet? Oh, that's no.
and a ready pad. That way we can go ahead and get, you know, when we start getting animals in here, we can start putting them in here and start bringing off bat. There's another in here. into a cave. Incendi. Lumos. Pump juice. Chest. Everything in here. There wasn't a lot in here. Thought there'd be more than that. Uh. I guess we need to eventually start moving animals around into their. Uh, Appropriate habitat, as it were. But for now, they're fine. So far, the swamp has had the least amount of uh, resources. And as a swamp mage, I find that offensive. Mm -hmm. I was hoping I'd go back there. Guess not. here. Uh, hey, hang on. Let's come up here. Uh, Revelio. on the burn. Come up here. There? 
Did they seriously put... Hang on. I think I'm just overthinking this. Damn it. Hit every single the one but the one I wanted to hit. I guess not. Yeah. Thought maybe I could build my way over there, but that's not gonna happen either. There's Nothing I can do, I guess. being a jackass and try and jump to the wrong island. Mm -hmm. we'll, just, we'll just ignore that. Still, don't feel like it's a whole lot of resources in the swamp. moonstone piles and some lacewing flies like that's not a lot let's go rescue us
my uh, side quest Maybe mission has, uh, bar has gotten longer and longer here. I still feel as if the broom is the best mode of transportation. Like, the animals are beautiful and all, but the broom is the most efficient. And the easiest to control, honestly. These rocks have seen better days. Paint the rocks. Someone's here, I think. No, I said land. Get off the moonstone so we can actually, you know, do something with it. Do you want to fight the troll? Not really? Okay. Say, yeah, I said enter. <laughs> A blockade. Rockwood's poachers are already here. Two lace wing flies there. So. Wait a minute. I just need this. This. Incendi. Bombarda. Could the phoenix be in there? Is this the way I need to go? Or is this the way I need to go? You don't think phoenixes can turn to rocks, do you? You've seen how much a single feather fetches. That's an old blue bird. Short answer is you just got wrecked. Okay, this is the way I have to go. So let's back up here. Incendiary. Oh, let's check out the other way. Just to make sure there's nothing cool down there. After all that, there was a chest. 
giant purple toad statue. I'm fairly sure it's not going to have the same effect as the other toad statues around Hogwarts. in here. More poachers. Pretty sure I fucked you up, that's what I did. <laughs> Did you survive that? Your poaching days are over. I'm really not sure how he lived. A phoenix. seems as if it wants me to follow it. I need to find it before the poachers do. I wonder if that's Fox the Phoenix. Because technically Phoenixes are immortal. Ish. I mean, they die, but they're reborn. Oh. I mean, that's seemed like a really bad decision and Alohomora I mean the dude just kind of like jumped out in front of me without warning by himself I'm confused as to what he thought he was going to accomplish. Like, there it is again. I killed dark wizards in large group numbers. What did he think he was going to do by himself? Uh, 
Okay, spiders. Shame you're so foul. You know what? Just go away. No, you're just supposed to die, honestly. That was for High Wing. The beasts are safer now. Incendium. Pretty birdie. Hello. I'm here to help. I can take you somewhere safe. Oh, I didn't even have to play mini game. He just jumped in the bag on his own. Back to the room. Deke's going to be pleased. While I'm out here, I might as well do this too. This looks intriguing. Oh shit.
Incendio. Hmm. Eight legs is simply too many. Oh, that wasn't picture perfect, but you get done. I actually it's forgot about him being out here. really a point that's truly a closer so Oop. gotta fly all the way out there a castle must have been quite stately in its time so you're kind of uh Looks like Jabber Knowles. Special points out here. Yep, over here. Just trying to gather uh, special points while I'm out here. That when I have to come back out here, I don't have to, you know, fly everywhere. I can at least have, you know, special points that are closer to a uh, target. Of course, I might play uh, a little bit off recording and off 
bring him a little bit later just to gather some more stuff more Merlin points more ancient magic sites gather up some more I might gather up some more of these flu network points approach all the collection stuff without doing any side quests or anything I, w I won't do anything like that while you guys aren't here Three balloons. There's four. Five. There we go. One. Two. The course looks rather deserted. I hope everything's all right. I'm over here. Hello again, Amelda. This course is a bit far from the castle, isn't it? Obviously. Evidently too far for most of our classmates. They should be begging me to keep these trials alive, not running scared. I'm surprised our new fifth year showed up. I suppose I appreciate the effort. That's actually, thank you. I know I can be impatient, but I get frustrated by those who don't take things as seriously as I do. And in my experience, that's everyone. Anyway, don't let it go to your head. Right then, enough chatter. I'm confident I've posted a time you won't be able to beat. We'll soon see how I fare, won't we? I'm ready. <laughs> Get ready to lose. Haha. -ha. <laughs> that wasn't too difficult. Ha -ha. Oh, are you kidding me? Why is it when I'm flying this thing? It's way like harder to handle for no freaking reason. This is going well. beat this course on this run, it's going to be a freaking miracle. Because at this point, I need to beat 239.42 because I'm going to have three seconds added because I missed a ring. saying yourself because I'm saying this is a dog shit flying. Oh! This thing is squirrely. I'm having a hard time holding it straight. This is 
going well. Really not. Holy shit, I did it. Even missing two rings and flying like dog shit. How bad are you? That was quite something. Impressive work today, but don't get too comfortable. I'll be on your heels in no time. My family's not going to believe the news when I tell them. They're almost as competitive as I am. Almost. Do you get your competitiveness from your family? You could say that. My grandfather played Quidditch for Puzzlemere United. And my father... Well, he was a chaser for Slytherin, but had to stop after a curse took his knees out. Said it was the Gryffindor beater. And sure me, it was. I fell in love with flying the first time I saw the ground disappear beneath my feet. Something about the freedom you feel on a brim. I've not been able to stop since. Will you keep running these courses? I'll race them myself. I don't want to get rusty. But I won't be dealing with time trials. You're welcome to run them too. Anyway, hope we find time to fly again soon. I take it you want to play for a team, but which one? And which position? I'm my father's girl. A chaser through and through. You'd know that if Black hadn't cancelled Quidditch this year. As for a team, it's the holy head harpies I've always dreamt of. When I'm finished with school, I'll try out. If for some reason I don't get accepted, I don't know what I'll do. Herbology, perhaps? Because if that did happen, <laughs> you might as well pop me and call me a mandrake. I'd never stop screaming. <clears throat> it's been fun competing against your records, Imelda. It has been fun. Glad you're here, fifth year. You're an asset to our house. You take care of yourself. I actually enjoyed that expression. I might start using it. I should let Mr. Weeks know that this was his best upgrade. Um, I think this one lasts longer if I remember correctly. Is that a rare spawn? Did that just get me a shiny measel? Hang on. The female. It doesn't say though. So I need a male measel. I'm guessing that is like a shiny rare spawn because it doesn't look like the others. And once again, it's an all female herd. no sense to me. That's just weird. I, I countered this the other day. Um, on the stream, I was, uh, I was trying to capture... I think it was a per giant purple toad. There were no male giant purple toads. They were all female. And then, oh, actually on the Slytherin the other day, uh, I was out looking for moon calves. There was all only female moon calves. There are no male moon calves. And now here I am looking at a herd of measles and they're all female.
Let's see here. Drop and roll. It's just weird. If anyone else like has any ideas, please let me know. That's just irritating. Actually, while I'm out here, um, no, I. Mm -hmm. Let's get one of these special points. So when I decide to come back, look for a male measle again. I can just special over here and have to fly that as far. I should investigate. Eh, I really shouldn't. Although I'm not too sure how safe of a point this is. Is it outside? They yeah. don't seem to care for me in Hogsmeade. Can't say I've all played. Someone messing about. When we're done here, I'm going straight to the Hogshead. Eh, let me fly back one more time. Maybe, like... Hey, mate, me grab me, pop these balloons, and I'll go check that beast den just one more time. Make sure no males spawned while I was away. Heck, maybe I flew enough. I hope I flew far enough away to, like, reset the spawn on that. down we get down here but uh, aha it did Matching pair of measles. Where we go. <laughs> Only had to fly far enough away to reset the spawn, I guess. What's this? Dairy call. I think those are the dodo bird looking ones. Let's head to yeah, LB. Before I head there. Make sure none of the gear I picked up is better than what I'm wearing. Just so I can go ahead and sell my gear while I'm there. Sell gear.
No, oh, yeah, save up, um, save up eight grand in galleons. Because that's how much the third and final upgrade costs for the broom is eight grand. Oh, I don't think anyone at the ministry wants to stay in As my favorite test flyer. <laughs> what are we you. looking for today? Which makes no sense because the first upgrade cost one thousand. The second upgrade cost four thousand. The third upgrade cost eight thousand. If they're on double each time, shouldn't have gone one, two, four. Thanks for stopping by. Hope to see you again. No problem. Now we're gonna go back to Hogs Ward. We're gonna go to the secret room. Did you find the phoenix? Yes, Deke. And I rescued it from the poachers. I have it here. It's safe. Remarkable. Well, what are you waiting for? Deke cannot wait to... Wait, I don't have an option to let Deke keep it? Professor Weasley and Deke were right to tell you about the Room of Requirement. Look at all you've done, and how many beasts you've rescued. A phoenix is safe now, because of you. I couldn't have done it without your help, Deke. Thank you. Uh, Deke is grateful for the kind words and also grateful to have been of assistance to someone like yourself. Helping you do such good for so many beasts has given Deke a sense of peace Deke hasn't known in years. Deke will always be here for you when you need him. Alright, um... Where to put the Deary Crawls? Mm. Actually, let's see what kind of environment this is. Like a coastline? Uh, 
Ah, you're eating. That's okay. Measle fur, measle fur. And since I got y'all here, let's breed some measles. Explore new vivarium and see all the monsters right here. Or the monsters, uh, beasts. appear to be too much here either to be honest it may actually be less here than in the swamp here and uh oh, crap brain fart what are we gonna do after we leave here return to albie jeez Derp and <laughs> brain fart. It's a good thing we have all of us. You're back. Nice to see you again. Hello again, Mr. Weeks. I set a new record at the South Course. Fantastic! Your broom performed well then. The best upgrade yet. It flew beautifully, incredibly nimble. But with the speeds it now reaches, I can feel the wind catching beneath the seat a bit, preventing it from reaching its full potential. Of course! Should have anticipated that! Exactly the kind of report I've come to expect from you! At last, I think I know what needs to be done for my final upgrade! What will you do after the final upgrade is complete? I aim to make spint witches the most sought after shop in Ogsmead. And I wouldn't mind getting back on a broom myself. Just for the thrill of it. Couldn't be more pleased we made headway with the upgrades. Proved the naysayers wrong. Made all the hard work worth it. I shall look forward to speaking again. I'll be sure to send you an hour when I'm finished. Thank you again for your help. Couldn't have done this without you. What are we looking for today? Thanks for stopping by. Time is it? Hope to see you again. Oh my god, we went a little bit over. 
<laughs> Anywho, uh, that's the stream today. Okay, stream, wow. Tells you what I just got done doing, huh? Uh, that's the that's the video today. I will see you guys next time. This is our Dental Mobile saying good night, good luck, and have fun. Bye.